say Coach Danola, who was who was my um my high school coach, he was tougher on me than my dad was. So, you know, that's just a a, a testament to to how how tough he was. You know, we we had many a fights. Um it didn't it didn't get physical, but you know, he he he's kicked me out of practice many times and but I I at the time I didn't understand it. Mm-hmm. Um but but I I get it. I get it now. I I got it later. But it was it was all just tough love and, and they just you know, Coach D and my grandmother and, and my parents, they just wanted the best for me. Got it the team. Like he kinda like came in and got rid of the seniors and the juniors and guys right, who right. felt didn't want to conform to what he was, you know, um trying to um, disseminate to them. And it opened up the door for you and gave you opportunity. Is that talk to me about that and, and what happened with that process? My relationship with, with D goes goes back to um to the camps that he used to hold at Mount Pleasant. Mm-hmm. So uh I used to attend attend his basketball camps that he used to he used to hold at Mount Pleasant because he went to Mount Pleasant. My mother and all my mother's brothers and sisters went to Mount Pleasant. So, you know, they 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 knew each other. Uh, Coach mm-hmm. D knew what kind of, you know, parents that, that he was dealing with. I, I had no intentions of playing varsity. That's, you know, that's what some people um, misunderstand. They, they, they think Coach D recruited me and, and saved a spot for me to play on varsity. That, was, that wasn't the case. Nothing is, nothing is handed to you by Coach Danola. Mm-hmm. Anybody that knows him knows that you have to earn every bit of playing time. You have to earn your, your, your spot on the team. There's no automatic spots. Just because you were on the team last year doesn't mean that you're, you're going to be on the team for the following year. And as you can see, the, the, the team, the previous team, that uh, Coach Abba had right before Coach Danola had, and and I went there as a freshman. There were only two players, maybe three, that were that were on the team from the right. from the previous year, and all of those dudes were now seniors, you know. So right. So um, you know, just to just to let you know what 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 kind of what kind of coach and what kind of disciplinarian Coach Danola was, you know, but. But I, I had no intention of playing varsity. I, I went to Schenectady High School, and I was I was like, yeah, I'm just I'm just gonna play freshman, average fifty, and just relax. <laughs> right. For real. But you know, Coach Danola had another plan that I I didn't know anything about. 